breaking news. Oh, good evening and welcome to channel 3276 Perth Nightly News. I'm Joshua White. On today's story, we have a breakthrough for the new COVID-19 pandemic cure. Professor Crumber Brain has the new cure. Over to you, our roving reporter, Mr. Marmalade. I'm um, Mr. Margarine. Thank you, Joshua White. The um, lady that gets me don't mind my eyes. I'm being affected by the COVID-19. And, and Professor Crumble Ray has got a cure. Professor Crumble Ray, what? tell us about your cure. Thank you, Mr. Margarine. Yes, it's been years of hard, hard work trying to get this done. But I have finally worked out this great new cure. There's a couple of side effects that I um, don't want to really talk about. But, uh, you know, at least it's better than the COVID-19 symptoms. Uh, and, uh, and sorry about my hair because, you know, I haven't been outside very much to get a haircut and stuff. Anyway, uh, let me show you what the... It's gone! It's gone! Where is it? And where's Mr. Margarine? <laughs> Breaking news. We've just heard that Mr. Crumblebrain's cure has been stolen. We're over to Mr. Marjorie for his next report on what happened to this case. Mr. Marjorie, over to you. Mr. Marjorie, Mr. Marjorie. Go. It looks like Mr. Marjorie isn't here at the moment. Josh, any thoughts? Oh my God! What's happened to your eyes? What? What's going on? <laughs> ah! I've got the virus! Oh my god, I've got the virus. This virus is spreading like wildfire. Oh, this could be the last time I'm talking to you guys. Oh, Mr. Crumblebrain, please tell us you have an update. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Mr. Crumblebrain is useless. Absolutely useless. I don't know. You've got it too! You've got what? the virus! What? What are we gonna do? Get, Get Detective, Detective Jeremy on the case! We're in trouble. Mr. Margarine is on the loose. We have to find Mr. Margarine. Hmm. Fact one, he has blue hair. Fact two, he wears a yellow cap. Fact three, he does a fart noise and I just heard it. Ah, it's just little Mrs. Pinksy. That tastes disgusting. Oh, my eyes are much better. I, I know uh, Detective Jeremy's on my trail. Oh, my voice is back to normal. <laughs> oh, no, I better not. A fart! He can smell my fart from over here! Ah, damn, that smells disgusting! Ah. Oh, this stinks! It's disgusting! Ah, you're never gonna get me! I'm going away! Boris ah. Bailey, my detective! Chase after Mr. Margarine! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on, the ah! Come on! Ah! 
come on. Now what you doing? Hey. Uh, come on! Breaking news. Somebody's got to catch that Mr. Marmalade or Mr. Margarine or whatever the bloody hell his name is. Anyway, let's go over to uh, Professor Crumblegrain. Let's hope he's got another cure or another, you know, another cure for this virus. Everyone's dying here. <laughs> Mr. Crumblebane, pull yourself together, man. We need a cure. Give us an update. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Mr. Cromwell Grain. We need you to lift! Lift! Think of your children! Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, forget it. Yeah. Forget, forget Mr. Crumble Brain. Anyway, let's cross over to uh, the hospital, the ECU, uh, where we've got an update from Sophie. Thanks, Josh. I'm here at ECU Hospital. I'm here with Dr. James Vaughan and Dr. Stiona Fanley. They're here to give us a report at the hospital where the situation is just getting worse and worse and worse. Uh, um, we've noticed an increased number of uh... COVID patients, so we got uh, COVID patient number 66 and 67 uh, having high fever and um, presenting extreme uh, symptoms. Let's go. So we got uh, COVID patient 66 having a high fever. She needs paracetamol and um, some pop pop lotion on the face. Please help me. Please help me. COVID patient 67, having a shortness of breath. Would you su suggest Vicks by corrupt? Yeah, put some Vicks in the nose and pop pop in the ears. All good. Hehehehe <laughs> <laughs>